guys, I clicked on the stream. I still got it up. Oh my god, I'm gonna record this entire thing. This is the uh, the aftermath of what happened when he got reported for copyright infringement. So Stolas clearly he likes boys. Like if you watch SML and you watch, you know, you like Cody and whatnot, you know, Stolas likes boys. He likes men. He likes dingling. So him being forced to marry a girl, I mean, but being royalty, it comes with the job, right? It comes with the job. You can't get too upset. Katie, all thank you so much for being a member for six months. Hey, what's up? How you doing? And Dan Gaming. Thank you so much for that donut. I thought you were actually episode one and two already. I'm doing a little refresher because. Um, they drop episodes like sporadically, so you know, I thought it'd be a little nice to get a little fresher in. So, we're gonna watch episode one, and then two, and then three. Don't worry, we're gonna watch episode three. But yeah, Stolas likes boys, he's um, he, he, he's on the other side of the rainbow, and he has to marry this girl that he doesn't even like. Can you imagine? Can you imagine? How does that usually work? person aroma. How does a poor person smell like? Probably like, um, um, probably smell like, uh, bird cheek. What? <laughs> oh my gosh! Nobody likes clowns! So this, this is Blitzo. My boy Blitzo at a young age. Love at first sight. Love at first sight. Who is 
Johnny. Uh, Are you really going to make a horse? Okay. I thought he was going to make something else that wasn't a horse. But something a horse has. It was pretty big. Damn, bro, you suck at this. Give it up. You know how some people say, like, it's their dream to do this and that? Looking for. Sometimes you just gotta let your friends know they can't rap. Oh, and, uh, Janet Bula. Do they still live here? Wait, bro, you can't rap, I'm sorry. We used to play together. You suck. Next door, my name is William. They are both dead. Okay, he knows how to improvise. That's cool. What were you doing on our farm spying on us? No, no. They make no sense. His name is Shin. I forget his name though, but that is not his brother. That is that is somebody important to him, and we see him later on in the series. I completely forgot his name, so if you can remind me in the chat who is this guy on the right, I'll be very, very, very grateful because I know that's Blitzo, and I know we definitely see him. He becomes a villain if I'm not too mistaken. Like I said, this is supposed to be a little, a little pressure. Fizzaroli, Fizzaroli, there we go. Fizzaroli. Fizzaroli. This is Fizzaroli. Thank you, thank you. And he does become like a villain in the future. But right now, him and Blitz are working together. They cool, they cool. You know, they was, they was friends. They was, they was kicking it back in the day, you know. Ain't no beef right now, but in the future, you know. It seems like he's better at this than you, Blitzo. Oh, stop. Is that a real thing? I don't own horses. Unlike people think everyone from Texas rides on horses. No. Could you imagine, like, your whole job is to hold up a mirror? <laughs> That's why he's doing this, like, eternal, like, this is my life expression, bro. You had one life, and your your job is to hold up a mirror. Damn. Damn. What the fuck was that? What did I do to upset That's Splitzo's dad, I assume. Huh? We can't just buy people. We outlaw. We outlaw this. They have a feeling you want to take care of them every day. We can help each other. We work together. Don't let them trust you. Take care of them. Take care of them. He wants Blitzo, not Fizzaroli. How much you gonna sell him for? Damn. <laughs> what a horrible father. You sold your son for a wadded up five dollar bill and a, a, a Trojan. No wonder Blitzo had a messed up child, I mean, adulthood. Enjoying life. Are you enjoying it here? Yes, it's nice. <laughs> you and Lazarus are getting along, I see. You see, you made him laugh. You made him laugh, you see. What did you talk about? Things. Blitzo's a cool guy. How can you hate him? What things? I mean, he is a murderous in. He knows a lot about nature. Worms and butterflies and stuff. I see. He said there were lots of butterflies competing. Look, I can't sleep in hell. Humans once they died. Okay. Not bad. I got McDonald's too. He said there were many nesting in two beautiful worlds. We are these worlds. Spend the day, he says. Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> Do you believe this? Ah. Oh. doesn't want to do that. Well, what an innocent 
heart, man. What an innocent heart. Hey, just don't get caught, bro. Just don't get caught. You won't get in trouble if you don't get caught, but that's not the way to live life. Hold on, let me go right ahead and read these donations, because that would be so kind of me. Woody McQueen, thank you so much for that dono. You always say that poop particles get in your drink if you bring your drink to the bathroom. What about toothbrushes and bathrooms? I actually um, keep my toothbrush, like, I'm talking about, like, 10 feet away from my uh, toilet. And my toilet has a door, so, like, it stays closed. So trust me, there ain't no poop particles on my toothbrush. There's poop particles on your toothbrush? Huh? Ew, y'all brushing your teeth with poop particles? Gross. Nancy, couldn't be me. Uh, miraculous, thank you so much for being a member for nine months. Appreciate appreciate you, bro. Caden John, thank you so much for that donation, man. First dono from Caden John, thank you. Sammy DeVito, thank you for that donation. Awesome stream so far, ready for pain and hardship. Is that what I'm gonna experience if I continue to watch this? Maybe I should end the stream right now. Uh, Kaden, thanks so much for that donut. Hell, do you like SML? How many videos did you watch? I think I've watched all of SML's videos at this point. And Winter Wolf, thank you so much for being a member for 13 months. Yo, Prince, Blitz is one hell of a boss. I have to agree with you, man. I have to agree with you. So, what we just saw right now, Blitzo's dad is basically selling Blitzo off to, uh, Stolas's dad. So, Blitzo can be Stolas's playmate. Uh, I don't know if it's permanent or just for the day. It made it sound like it was going to be permanent, but I guess it's just for the day because the dad expects Blitzo to steal from Stolas because, like, he got money, he royalty. Like, they're not going to miss a couple of golden, gold, gold, go, what do they call those? Goblins? Goblins? Go, go, the balloons? No. <laughs> goblins. Goblins. There we go. Golden goblins. They're, they're not going to miss it. So let's go ahead and get back into it. This, 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 sca this scandalous ass father, bro. We don't like him. We don't like him. Screw you. <laughs> Is Blitzo with a silent O? So it's just Blitz? Just Blitz? There are scarier things, like AIDS. AIDS is pretty scary. Here is a new friend, my son. A happy birthday. No, it is Blitzen. <laughs> Name one difference between a frog and a toad. Yeah. Yeah. Be easy on him, Blitz. Young Blitz. Uh, oh, this is when we get to Robin. This is when we get to Finesse in. We running so pockets. Uh, wife, family, mm -hmm. kids. Yes. Hidden licks. I didn't have a wife in there. Okay. My wife died right before this. And then there was a fire. Don't think they had windows. I could be safe. Damn, you gotta vote for everything. Damn. Nancy Drew? Oh, bookworm? <laughs> I'm kidding, I'm kidding. <laughs> Even that chandelier would like set y'all for life, bro. Golly! Like, why do royalty need such expensive things? We know why. I don't even know why I'm asking. They need it because they don't want you to have it. <laughs> oh, just give me a couple. Just give me a couple of those balloons, man. Pay off my house. So what ancestors are. I need, I need Mr. Beast to, like, pay off my house or something, bro. This must be a powerful I need him to start a foundation or something mm -hmm. a challenge. Mm -hmm. He rigs it and lets me win. Only those who are chosen by the ancestors. There's way too much to steal at this house try. anyways. Oh, I was right, the chandelier! Oh, no, that's not the same chandelier, but still. 
Ooh. That was expensive. You know, go ahead and get you a little souvenir. Break off a little piece. Like, they're both experienced two different things. Blitzo's like, I hit the biggest lick in the history of licks. And Stolas is falling in love. Is that his bum of a father? Yep. Go ahead and throw it. Might as well. Woo! Big money. Blitzo's dad just came up big time. Hey, Asuka. Azima Hulk. Antima Hulk. Circus technically, like there's no animals and jumping through flaming rings and circles, but he does run a, a, a assassin company, which is damn near run like a circus. They act like they're clowns, and he gets to do essentially whatever he wants. So seems like he achieved his dream. <laughs> dream big, kids. Blitzo achieved his dream, and he's an imp. He's a demonic imp. If he can do it, you can do it. somebody you've loved for 25 years? Never. Give it up. Nope. That's not happening. Now, I think the reason for this copyright strike, yeah, I know, like, someone snitched on him, Rin reported him, but I'm pretty sure I'm, this is like a series on Netflix or something, so that might also be why it got copyrighted anyways peace out that was an archived clip of this oh no